It's okay. I'm gonna go buy a lot. All right, guys. Of so gather around just so everyone can hear me. I'm gonna switch to shouting just so y'all can hear me. Um, so the next, so this last station uh, is Seaburny. I wanted to do it together because uh, it's a little different, and I think, as far as I know, I'm the only person who's played around with this mod. Um, so how this works is like this: uh, in any good um, Seaburny course, uh, you're gonna basically expose yourself to some kind of dangerous thing and then you're going to treat the exposure as well as verifying that your equipment works. So basically we do it like this. There's a board right over here and some equipment over here. Come on in. Uh, everyone is going to need a mask, a suit. You're going to want three decontamination kits, three anecdotes, and three detection kits. Um, as, you're getting the, as you're getting the shit, I'll just, just for your edification, just in case you're curious, um, the um, flipping, what was I going to say? Did you say three uniforms? One uniform, yeah. one, one hood, and then three each of the uh, items in the silver case. Uh, the RT wrap pack. No, the the I see the the, uh, the hood. suit, the uh, CBRN uniform M50. To be near the top of the list. There you go. And then a mask. Make sure you have a mask. Yeah, right. I got the uniform. I got the right uniform. Yeah, looks, looks like okay. it, bud. Looks like you're wearing the M50, and looks okay. like you're wearing the M50 mask. So, All right. at the very least, as long as you leave that on, you won't die. Um, oh. oh, please put that down. Oh. Uh. Yeah. Oh, oh god. Yeah, please, please, please let go. Thank you. All right. Trying so to make a monkey out here's of you. so basically before we even go in, once everyone's done, let me. And everyone's standing still for just a second if you're done. Looks like I got everybody in a mask. And I don't see anybody wearing... Am I wearing? No, I'm good. And I don't see anybody else wearing the... Okay, perfect. So, right now, you should be able to go into your A's inventory, and there should be a new option at top, CBRN. Um, what you're going to... What you want to do, the first thing, is hit your detection kit. And you'll see it'll say, check self or check area. If it's check self, that'll check to see if you yourself are contaminated, your body. And the area is, hey, am I in a contaminated area? Let's check the area right now. Hold, hold on a second. Let me... Did you say... Medical, 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 no. surrender, gestures? No, no, no. no. You, the, you obviously haven't collected the uh, the items from the, from the silver crate, so make sure you get three of each of these. The antidote kit. Plus the checking the area, right? The contamination kit. Many. There's a sign behind you in case you get turned around. Chemical agents were not detected. Correct. Since we're in a safe area, it's, it's going to come back non-detected. What this simulates is if, you, if anyone here has actually done the military Seaburny courses, um, most militaries use basically a chemical detection tape. It's kind of like, almost like uh, camera film. You expose it to the air, and if there's chemicals and other agents in the air, it'll show up as a bunch of little multicolored dots on the tape. So that's basically what we're doing. We're exposing the tape to the air, waving it around, and then looking at it and inspecting it for any of those multicolored dots. And what we've found by doing that is we're in a safe area. That tape is now done. We have to throw it away, but we're in a safe I area. I can't. I'm stuck in the air. Why are you stuck in the air? I have no idea. Okay. Well, it's either step over or climb up. No. There you go. Is this a dream Shit. where you float? What? <laughs> what is going on? I don't know. I'm fo floating in the take air. Wide. He's he's high Did on chemicals. Take some drugs, Snake. No, oh, I no, got the stuff out of the box and stepped right here and started floating. Okay. Uh, I, th I think oh, it's the geez. tent. I think it's the tent, honestly. All right then, maybe I'll. Uh, I want we'll to float too. All right, because I can't move. Some sort of object here. Give me a second here, fellas. I can't move. Calm down. Get out of the tent, Snake. Vault towards the. I don't understand why this is happening. There's some sort of object here. It's, it's it can happen, it'll happen to me. Snake, snake. Right. Tent vault. Tent. Way. Here, I'm just going to delete the tent. There, tent's gone. Alright. That's it. Okay, cool. So it was a tent. Alright, guys, so oh, gather back around. There's, there's a lot of us. Let's stay focused here. Um, so, yeah, now that you know how to detect whether or not there's chemicals in the area, yep. let's go see if there's chemicals inside this shed here. Come on. I think there's chemicals inside the shed. Oh, there's almost <laughs> certainly chemicals inside the shed. Context clues, guys. Danger. <laughs> all right. Once everybody's in, all right. Looks like everybody's in. Go Those ahead and use another uh, use another detection kit and see if there's any chemicals in the area. There should be. Uh, detection kit. All right. 
Okay, is there room full of propane? Check the area. Right. Chemical agents were no, detected. Detained. So it looks like chemical agents were detected. All right. Yep. So uh, that is here. Like this is a contaminated propane. area. It's a good thing we're wearing all these all this protective equipment. So uh, what we're gonna do is in a minute. Don't do it right now. Don't do it as I'm talking because you'll probably die. Uh, in a minute, we're gonna take off our masks. We're gonna expose ourselves to the agent that's in here, and then we're gonna put our mask back on. What that's going to do is, once we're contaminated, we're going to need to decontaminate ourselves, and then we're going to need to treat ourselves. So it's going to go like this. You're going to take your mask off, wait a second, you'll get a little pop-up saying it's hard to breathe, you'll put your mask back on, and then you're going to want to use pretty much each of those three objects. You should have one more detection kit, you'll want to check self, and you'll see, hey, I'm contaminated, and then you're going to want to use the uh, uh, self-decontaminate kit, and that'll clear the, the junk out of your body because of video game magic. And then the antidote kit will reverse the effects of the, uh, of the contaminant that you were just affected with. Does that make sense? One comment. Yep. Yep. The, uh, All right. So if you don't have any questions about, how, about what's happening, no. go ahead, take your mask off, get contaminated, put it back on, and then clean up. <sighs> oh, yeah. Feel that. Feel that tear gas. All right, smells I'm contaminated. like I'm burning. Yep. So I'm going to detect right, self. What? Put it back on. Yep. Alright. I don't know about you guys, but I seem to be contaminated, so I'm going to self-decontaminate. Alright. And then I'm going to use an antidote. Yep. Hard to breathe. That's it. All right, and the antidote might not work if you do it fast enough because you may not have actually received any real damage. All right, and then one last thing. Turn to a That's neighbor, it. and you'll notice that with Interact Others, you can do all those actions on the next guy in the unit. So if someone is a casualty or they can't Got take it. care of themselves for any reason, you can actually do all these actions on a buddy to... So uh, I can decontaminate him. him. Got it. All right. And that's it. That's the last that's station. It. We're all done. You're, you're Yay. Famous. Cool, huh? Yay. Nice. I like that. All right. Let me end the mission here. Yay. I'm so happy. What does turn on cooker do? Hey, Aiko. No, oh. it. Your hat, your hat right. is going. Oh, I forgot to remove that. It's just, I'll be it's back. It's supposed to make like a smoke effect. What the?